the Lape Indians hunted for beaver. And Henry Hudson was really excited about that because that meant he could go back to where he was traveling from, which wasn't England, but which was the Netherlands, and say, you know, I didn't find spices, I didn't find gold, but they got fur. And that was the first thing that they started trading. And that's He started this residency by creating trade books. One of the challenges that teachers have is getting their students to write. The trade book format integrates illustration and collage, allowing the students to document their research in a creative way. Our belief is when students go through the process of creating something, they internalize the information at a higher level, giving them something to talk about. With this gained knowledge, they can effectively present their work to their peers and families in an oral presentation. So what we're showing for making hair is that if you tear the pieces of paper, it kind of looks a little bit more authentic than... All right, so we're going to use this. We'll make do with what we have, okay? We're going to compromise. You go like this, look. That's pretty good. Just make it a little bit more over here, and then I think it's perfect. I really liked the class. When I heard about it, I, I felt really excited. I really like it because mostly it shows the creative side of people, and you don't really get to see that side of people. And he needs eyeballs and eyebrows. we got to fill in his whole face, okay? All right, come on over here and shop. Upon the completion of trade books at PS5, the fifth grade teachers decided that mask making would be a great extension to their social studies unit. When I first heard about the arts program, I was very excited about it because I was looking for a way to bring some creativity to my social studies lesson. One of the units that the kids have to study is Latin America. The kids created these books and they were so interested in finding out more information um, through the creation of the books that they made in, through the art program. They created murals in the back and they did research in the front. The kids learn more through my lessons this way than me just talking in front of them. They worked through the arts program, they created masks, they, they learned about culture, tradition, the history of the country that they had to research. You can either paint or you can use tissue paper. Those are your options, okay? It's one of these projects that you gotta really love getting messy, all right? It's a, it's a project that you get allowed to be messy. Now we're talking. All right, so now. Do you, do you have what you need over here for yours? Let me see. Even for my struggling students, they were able to uh, talk where they couldn't write and they created these pockets that had this information that they could research and talk from. So even students that were little strugglers were able to participate and learn. And so that was my biggest um, surprise and my biggest gratefulness for having this program. Okay, now turn it over for a minute. Let's see at the back. Now you see, you want this to come over. It doesn't have any glue there and cover the top, but make sure you wrap it around, all right? So what is that? Tell me again, what's Day of the Dead? I, I need Day to be- Day of the Dead is like a celebration where they celebrate the people that pass, mm -hmm. and they wanna, um, they wanna remember them. Wow, this is looking fantastic! Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know why you put green on top of it? Yeah, well this is instead of her painting, she's using the tissue paper, right? Isn't it cool? Painting is better. Well, there's just two different techniques. It's not better or worse. It's just it's a different better. way of doing it. And then if you think about what it was reminding me of, like in Mexico, like the pinatas and stuff, right? So they would use the tissue paper to make that, right? I'm very much looking forward to us coming in next week and going to the celebration where the students now are inviting their families in. So they're going to do a presentation with their masks on display like a museum exhibit, and then the books will be there for the parents to read. And one of the things that I really want to reinforce is everything is about trade books now, because I think it's more engaging because they really make the connection that they're making their own trade book right. so that someone else can learn from them.